welcome once again to loveliness by nature you're in a dating relationship and she's been asking you hey babe when are you proposing if this statement makes you to scratch your head or maybe your own situation is you've just gone to get the ring you've gone ahead and booked the venue and getting family and friends now together for the surprise public declaration of love or yours has even gone far you've actually proposed and mm, your mind now starts asking you questions what is this relationship leading to will it ever actually progress is she the right girl for me is she the one for me you constantly beating yourself hard if you're this confused today i'm going to add some point that will give you some reassurance of when you should actually walk away from her if she leaves you wondering this much let me start by saying true love is when you have her and only her in your thoughts at all times and you cannot imagine someone else in your life who is not her if this is not the case though the relationship you end now i mean right now if you find yourself often thinking about what life would be like with other women this means you do not have any good relationship at all you don't even have a relationship so this topic is not for you however if you are daily darling in your thoughts about this particular girl then sit and let's have a talk together number one you are never not yourself in a presence be in a relationship where you have to always be extra conscious of what to say to her she's always critical about you even if you have put a lot of effort to please her or make her life more comfortable or you want to go to places you will enjoy and if she does not let you hang out with your friends anymore because she doesn't like them they are not as classy as posh as rich as 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 many as or she doesn't even want you to dress the way you want and not helping you to achieve the perfection she desire but rather look down on you for your choice of dressing why all this fuss? This is just dating and all this is happening. That kind of relationship does not long. It won't last long, bro. She's not the one, walk away. Number two, she does not care about your goal and your ambitions. If she's not happy about your success, or smile when you tell her about the things that get you excited. Because, let's face it, she doesn't have to help you achieve your goals though. But at least, she should be able to support you even to give you the space to do what you need to do. If every of your goals and plan is stupid and unrealistic to her, listen, it is right of her to give you constructive criticism of your plan but if all she says is negative ideas at all times bro mm, 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 walk away she's not the one because god isn't stupid he creates us all with senses some might be more than the other do if yours is actually small senses she's to compliment it and not condemn it if she now does the latter bro she's definitely not the one are you liking my video if you are here to join my family, kindly click on the subscribe button. Give this video a huge thumbs up. Thank you. The next point, it is hard to keep a conversation. <laughs> Having things in common to talk about is very important so that there's going to be a connection between the two of you. If you think that you and your partner cannot talk for hours without getting bored easily or rather of having fun and plenty of flirtatious, friendly, playful conversation, now there is a lot of argument, bro. You both need a lot of sweet nonsense to talk about. But if instead of this, only you do is argue there's possibility of more arguments in the future that's why having spent a lot of time together there's still uncomfortable silences or all, all your conversation is officious or all our answer to your conversation is always close-ended responses yes no mm, yeah yeah okay if you say i love you and all you get is mm, thank you this is a no-no every 
couple should feel free enough with each other to talk about any topic under the sun, no matter how ridiculous or stupid, it is that is even more accepted between both of you. You don't have to be two officials together. But if this is the case with both of you, something is amiss. Is it that she's hiding something or she's not the one for you? Bro, what do you do? Exit. Work away. Sorry. Number four. You're the only person she's nice to. Woo. Really? I want you to start paying attention to how she treats people who work with her, or most especially her subordinate, if she treats them like rubbish. If you if you miss nice, is it nice to the waiter at the bar? Then she's not really a nice girl. I, it won't take long before she display her real character to your mom, your dad, your sibling. The moment you're married, you might say that's not a big deal. We're not going to live with my family or her family. But you're going to live with neighbors, work with colleagues, meet up with people on the bus, even in worship places. No matter how hidden she is right now, wait for it she will shock you soonest you don't want to wait for the time you won't be happy to come back from work to a troublesome wife at home the one that will give you panic attack at the slightest argument yes but same goes for men though mm. you like my video <laughs> And what's more of this, please do click on the like button and help share this video to loved ones. Thank you. Number five, she never trusts you. The one that will never trust you are the ones to avoid. If she constantly asks you about your ex-girlfriends, despite you've explained the reasons you broke up, she refused to understand that there was a reason you broke up years previously. If she also tries to force you into abandoning your female friends who you've always had a platonic relationship with and never a romantic one, despite you've tried to include her so that she can see there's nothing going on behind her back and the female friend is here for business, but your girl is embarrassingly bitchy to the point that you cannot even take her out anywhere due to the excessive jealousy attitude and always full of anger. If she is the one for you, she will trust you and have full assurance that no one will occupy a, a space in your heart. But if it is otherwise, this kind will never change. And you need to, to just dump her on the spot. Finally, before I leave, let's recap by answering these questions. Do other attractive girls seem attractive to you or less attractive? What do you like the most about her? Does she get along with your family? How often do you fight? How is the sex life with her? Is it enduring and happy to go into? If you were to break up today, will it affect you a lot? It will give me an amazing feeling if you could leave your answers below in the comment section and tell me why you like this video. And I will see you in the next video. Bye!